Greek bishop proclaims that a woman is not R-worded. I'm using this word for uh, you, the sake of YouTube. R-A-P-E. R yeah. Okay. A woman is not R-worded unless she wants to be. A Greek Orthodox ex-bishops recently appeared on national television to confirm the church's stance against abortion and then went on to make comments about RIPE that have sparked outrage throughout the southeastern European country. 83-year-old uh, Metropolitan Kriostomos of Doduni appeared on Sky TV on September 2nd, and after endorsing the church's hardline stance against abortion, he explained why there should be no exceptions for RIPE. He stated, quote, a woman does not sit and get R-worded without wanting it. A woman is not R-worded unless she wants to be. He then said there is no way a woman can conceive without, quote unquote, participation. So it would be impossible for a woman to become pregnant in this manner. His statements have sparked massive outrage throughout Greece. According to the Church of Greece, the comments by the former bishop are, quote, unacceptable for an Orthodox cleric and offensive for human beings and especially for women and victims of RAPE. Nikki uh, Karamius, Minister of Education and Religious Affairs, called the remarks unthinkable and reprehensible. Politicians from all parties have voiced their objections as well. Aside from the official reactions, the Greek people were infuriated and took to social media to express their opinions. So this how, was just wild. I think this is great news. Uh, this guy just woke Please up clarify. one day. <laughs> I mean, this guy just woke up one day and decided, like, how could I make, how could I take the most giant dump on the authority of the church in Greece? Like, like, and he, I think he managed to accomplish yeah, the Yeah, that's one way thing. to put it. <laughs> so, wait, how high up is this guy? This guy was, so he's retired. So oh. his title as a bishop at this point is basically honorific. Mm -hmm. um, he's not actively participating, but he's still, he was very high up. That's very high opinion. up. So I don't really good. understand. The Greek Orthodox Church is different than the Catholic Church, which is what I'm used to. So I don't understand the different levels as well. It's kind of similar. Um, yeah. but he seemed like pretty notable. It's amazing how the definition that he, like, it, it's basically the, exactly the opposite. Like is co is comedic. Like a woman is not R worded unless she wants to be like, it's literally it the exact, be R wording. No, it's basically the exact opposite of the definition. Yeah. It's the exact <laughs> like, opposite of what that is. <laughs> It's like the very opposite. It's the mirror image of it. It's uh, beautiful. Um, also, I don't understand his idea that women cannot conceive without participation. So it would be impossible bad, for a woman to become pregnant. This like, is a bad abortion. Oh, yeah, I can, just, I can just switch it on and off. Like, what is his understanding of how conception works? Like, I can just, do I maybe have, like, little funnels? And I can choose, like, oh, no, this doesn't go, the egg doesn't travel here. I'm going to prevent it from, like... Mm. I don't know. Can you? You let us know. Can you do this? <laughs> I have little on and off ramps. <laughs> I mean, we do. We like we use the same tunnel for two different things and we switch it. So you guys don't have that? No, I haven't been upgraded no. to that model yet. <laughs> no, <laughs> this is why we're the superior in sex. Um, but <laughs> no, but um, it's amazing. Do you think like, I think this is about abortion? Maybe I'm wrong about this. Like, this I all think, started like, when... because he was talking about abortion. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wait. Did you say this is his justification that? of why? Oh, yeah. You there said should that be already. no exception for RAPE in yes. abortion. This is his justification, yeah, okay. saying like, yeah. "Oh, well, it's impossible for this to happen if that was the case." Okay. To so be it's fair... not actually RAPE if you conceived. To be fair, okay, oh, to be no. fair to him, okay, well, not to be fair to him, okay, I have been with women that told me that don't worry, if they don't come, they can't get pregnant. Okay, so you mean be fair in the sense that women also have dumb ideas about how they can Yeah, 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 them. women about their own body. They were like, don't worry, yeah. don't worry, we don't need to use a condom because, like, if I don't If come, I don't orgasm, I can't get pregnant? I, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What the <laughs> hell? I'm like, first of all, that's not a compliment. Um, I make everybody come. So <laughs> that's <what I'm... laughs> 
that's you're not, like girl that is still a concern okay <laughs> that, yeah 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 so if <laughs> you're like don't, don't worry like i'm actually even more worried now <laughs> you have no idea what's about to happen to you <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right. <laughs> you are a menace to society. <laughs> yes, yes. Um, all right, this was overall like okay to be, and also this is another good news, okay? Because what we're seeing is the reaction is like overall condemnation, right? So the, uh, Greece yeah. is like not as backwards as this guy. So this is overall funny and good, and a giant dump on the authority of the church in Greece. Overall, this is pretty good. This is yeah. pretty good. I, I'm not average. I'm actually happy. It was so funny. There were people that came forward and basically said that what he um, said was basically like slanderous to the Greek Orthodox Church. Like, yeah, it, yeah they're like, you're slandering the church. How dare you say this? Wrong I know. I, I know you're slandering the church. Please continue. Please continue. You're like, keep going. Keep going. Don't stop. Don't stop, old man. Yeah. Um, all right. Oh, we're getting to Indiana. So ridiculous. Anything in the like, I think life people forget or... like the Orthodox churches are so patriarchal. Yeah. So well, I mean, patriarchal. Also... Like the Catholic Church is actually like progressive in comparison to the really? Greek and or Russian Orthodox Church. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I didn't know that. I didn't know they're more patriarchal. Maybe they've just been less under scrutiny. Okay. I think that's Can part we, of it. They're they're not as large. Yeah, they don't get such media. Like they're not on the news all the time, like the Vatican is. So the Vatican is yeah. more under pressure to get up to, to be a little bit more up to date. All right, Shreem's can we just bringing up a good point? He's saying they literally call their fathers patriarchs. Yeah, actually, that's a good point. Wait, their own their own biological fathers? No, no, no. So instead of oh. how you call a priest father, yeah, like on them... certain levels of priests or fathers within the holy scion they're called yeah. patriarchs like the yeah. head of the russian orthodox church is called patriarch kirill like okay. that's his I title thought, for a second there i thought like a girls called their actual fathers like hey patriarch <laughs> like literally they call them patriarch okay. <laughs> all right get my best-selling book why there is no god for free click on the link for it in the description